quick disclaimer before the video starts. This vlog is not your normal vlog. I literally like have no footage. I'm sorry I'm not good at vlogging. Plus it was like a family vacation. And let's just say there were some conflicts. Alright, so now I'm gonna fill you guys in on the trip plan. We're going to three places this trip, Taiwan, Japan, and China. Kinda in that order. So the plan is to go to China first. And yes, I know I just said in that order like two seconds ago, but hear me out. We're gonna go to China and drop off some luggages at our relative's house. Then we're gonna go to Taiwan, and then from Taiwan, we're gonna go to Tokyo. And then from Tokyo, we make our way to Osaka. And then from Osaka, we're gonna fly back to China. Well, like Hong Kong and then Guangzhou, but you get the gist of it. So right now, we're here flying to Hong Kong, but we have a connection at NRT Airport or Narita Airport in Japan. We have managed to, I don't know, but managed to get to our, what's it called? What is this? The port? And now we're just walking around for fun. I get bruh. Here's a nice photo of Robbie and I waiting patiently at the gate. Wait a minute. Rewind that. <gasps> it's a child that spilled milk on me! It spilled milk on my socks and I had to go wash it. Damn, look at my disappointment. No. And a moment of silence for my dyslexia. And for your information, I literally said close your eyes by Ed Sheeran to Robbie. Hey. Bro, they spilled tea on me. And then and then they just hand me a bunch of napkins. I'm like, oh yeah, that's nice. <laughs> I was like, why are you handing me a stack of napkins? And then I realized all the napkins. She handed me all those soap napkins. <laughs> okay, well... Okay... Okay. I have the hands of a surgeon. What? So, um, we're here in, um, the Japanese airport while we were waiting for our flight to go to connect to Hong Kong. And our flight is at 10, and we landed here at 3. So now we're gonna go kill time and eat food. But we already walked, and it's been, it's right now like almost, it's like 5.30. So we walked, we wanted to sit, but then our parents were like, oh, come to the place we just, we were just there to eat. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, we're again here because oh, we went to get food, but we didn't actually get food, and now Robbie wants to get food, so we're gonna actually go back to a convenience store to get food. So for your information, I've been eyeing this red cassiok for like a long time and if you don't know, these things retail at around like 99 USD and so that's like a 136 Canadian, well on the official G-Shock website it says it's 140 and with taxes, that puts it at like 160 CAD and let's just say the yen was weak and guess who got a new watch? Um, me! Uh, that's right, I got it for like 117 CAD, and I think that was a steal. Hong Kong airport at like 2 a.m. Um, we're taking a boat from Hong Kong to Guangzhou. I don't know. What else? Is there anything else? No? Yeah. Very boaty. Mountain. Alright, 
please excuse my voice i'm sick right now anyways from here on out i basically forgot to record videos so i'll just um you know do a monologue of the photos and if there's videos i'll just put them in all right so we didn't stay here for long we stayed for like two nights it was like super hot here's a photo of robbie dying and here's this one of me and after i got a cold treat i was revived anyways um and then we did more walking in the heat and of course even though it wasn't much we went shopping and here's what we copped the first time around totally not foreshadowing anything also our grandparents and relatives kind of gave us some you know ching ch ching please spend money responsibly and now we head to taiwan okay so a lot happened here including many hotel crisis robbie and i had to endure all right another hotel and it's absolute crap again and when i say a lot i mean a lot of sightseeing so you might be wondering what am i getting at seeing all of this so um i kind of promised myself i was gonna post this video before university started and let's just say right now it's august 31st and school starts in two day two three two three days so you know what i'm gonna make this into parts because the next part in taiwan has a lot of videos of me complaining and yes, I did move. This is my new room. And that is a whole nother video. I'm trying to be more responsible now and make proper videos, so... No guarantees in U of T engineering! Alright, 